Good afternoon. You know the fire danger is high and there are extremely tight fire restrictions in the Sandias and Manzanos. But in a week and a half, you won't even be allowed in those areas, period. That means no camping, driving or hiking. Matt Morrow has more. It's a long and windy road up to the Sandia Crest, and it's going to be a long day for these four firefighters. But we typically just, you know, walk the trails. You can hear as we walk, you know, the, the crunching of the leaves and, and the brush. It's super tender. There's a lot of cracking going on, so it is definitely dry. That's why Brett Malingo and his buddies are out here in the East Mountains, keeping the Sandia safe. They're U.S. Forest Service firefighters all the way from Montana, and every year they come here to keep campers and hikers following the rules, including no barbecue grill fires. Are you finding a lot of people following the rules? You know, I would say probably 85% of most people do a really good job at following the rules. Uh, we had a couple issues uh, a week ago. And that's the problem. Those issues, illegal fires, could start a wicked wildfire at any moment, especially because in the past four years, Brett has never seen the Sandia so dry. Fire sparks up out here. How quickly is it going to spread? How big is it going to get? With the wind today, I mean, a small fire, a campfire uh, getting away, it, it could be 20, 30, I mean, it could take, honestly, the whole crest down in probably a matter of days. Because of that, starting June 10th, the fire danger will be changed to extreme, and you won't be allowed in this picnic area or any of the Mountain Air or Sandia Ranger districts. No hiking, no biking, and no driving up to the crest, all to keep these homes and this forest wildfire free. People are warned now. People have been watching TV, radio. They know the conditions out here. Uh, don't challenge that rule or regulation. We will be enforcing it for sure. Everything is looking really good in here today. Like I said, there's nothing, nothing out of the ordinary. Well, that's the way Brett and the guys want to keep it, because checking a campsite makes for a much shorter day than fighting a fire. Matt Morrow, KRQE News 13. Again, the Sandias and Manzanos close starting Monday, June 10th at 8 a.m. Rangers say they will stay closed until we get a good soaking rain. That could be a while. The only areas of the National Forest that will remain open in the metro include the area right around the tram and Trail 365 at the foothills. The closure does not affect the open space areas that are part of Albuquerque and Bernalillo County.